Tonight's play, Present Laughter, is the first of four of my plays which will be televised during the next month. It is a flagrant example of what is known in theatrical parlance as a star vehicle, which means that though most of the parts in it are good, they are all subservient to the leading part. But I have been waking from a deep, deep sleep by everybody screaming like banshees. What's going on? I've been talking to Miss Stillington. Who the hell's Miss Stillington? She's in the spare room. I didn't ask where she was, Monica dear. I asked who she was. Erickson, get me some black coffee, please. Well, oh. You met at a party, brought her home, told her about your early struggles, and she stayed the night. Oh, her. Oh, I'm mad about her. What did you say her name was? Stillington. Daphne Stillington. The faintest idea was Stillington. I knew it was Daphne. Oh, why didn't you tell her dress quietly and go home? You know, it's agony here this morning. Everybody's banging about. She wants to say goodbye and to thank you. Whatever for? That, Gary, dear, I'm in no position to say. But Morris will be here in a minute, so just go in there, do a nice goodbye scene and get rid of her. There's a dear. All right, let me your sordid little comb and I will. Yeah. Good God. I look 98. In a few years' time, I'll be bald as a coot. Then you'll be sorry. I shall be delighted. There won't be so many eager, gently-bred debutantes ready to lose their latchkeys for you. <laughs>